Oh, more plants. Hey, plants are nice. Another. Huh. Oh, Thomas again. Your sister's room. Oh, where is she? Then? Mirrors. She's right there. Mirrors of various areas of crowded space. Oh, jeez. Creepy. Oh, there she is. I see her sitting at her desk. Your sister is too busy staring at herself in the mirror to notice you rifling through her wardrobe. Her silky undergarments were initially as I planted in the right place in my weave tail of her own. Leave the undergarments. Ornate clocks are your sister's third love. Right behind mirrors and cruelty. You don't want to sit around in this deranged place. Talk to your sister. I feel like if we talk to all of the people, then it might be dinner time. So let's look in the next room first. I think it's your room or a spare room. Ooh, another mirror. You don't look much like a murderer. Ah, uh, another memory. Mother says dinner is ready. Go away, little rat. Damn, she has big ass eyes. Jennifer, what are you doing? Why do you stare at your reflection like that? Stop making fun of me. I'm not making fun. I really want to know. I'm just... I just wish that... What, Jennifer? What do you wish? I wish you'd dr go drown in a lake. What the fuck? She's dark. Mother's waiting for you. No wonder he wants to kill her. Okay. Schizophrenia? My sister obsession with mirrors goes right back to her childhood. Never did understand why. Your form bed. Now a simple guest room. Most of your old furniture has vanished. Probably thrown in a bonfire knowing your father. Ooh, there's a fencing sword. Called it. Well, you can't use something that's his own. Yeah. Hmm. Don't have any blah blah blah. Wardrobe is vacant and bad. Emptied of whatever items. Yeah, another co a clock. Um. <laughs> bad. Long sleeves. Oh. Okay, let's go talk to the sister. And then we'll pick out some items. Yeah. We need to figure out who we're going to frame because I want to figure out from the sister whether she's in a relationship with the maid. Yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow! Where did I open? Oh, Aha, uh -huh. I thought I smelled a rat. Have you come to see me, little rat? Which one are you. F How it are takes you a rat to smell a rat. <laughs> Ooh. You can't vex her or else they're gonna think it's you. How are you feeling? Or I'm not a rat, I'm your brother. Uh, how are you feeling? How are you feeling? How, you been? how have I been? What odd thing for a little rat to ask? Why don't you just say squeak squeak? You used to have a pet rat, didn't you? Remember what I did to you messed up bitch. Oh how you squeak, such a great pain for such a little creature. What did you want to talk to me about, little rat? Mother seems very worried about you. I see you're still collecting mirrors. I see you're still collecting mirrors, I think. Okay. How many do you have now? 70. Wow. You use all of them at once. <laughs> of course not, what a silly question. They make you fun of my mirrors, little rat? You better not be. Go away, I don't want to speak to you anymore. Fuck. Sorry. Shit. We fucked up. Yes. Shit. Oh, shit. Oh, I was trying to be nice. Oh dear. Oh, because then like she th always thought that he was mocking her mirrors. Oh dear. Right, we should have listened to that. Okay. So, what we have so far, we have rat poison, mm -hmm. candlestick, rope, billiards cue, broom handle, mirror shard, poem, diary, knife, leather towel, leather towel. Shotgun undergarments. Hello. And defensing sword. Okay, let's cross off the fencing sword. Cross off the shotgun. Because that'll be too loud. So who do we want to frame? Maid, sister, father. Well the See the sister we can see have it as Or a, mother, but mother's not that much. We can do it as uh Well you, her her family thinks she's suicidal. Wait a minute, we can't do rat poison. Uh-huh. Because 
um, we had a rat, and if we killed her with the rat poison, it would just be too ironic, and they might figure out. Oh. That it no, was but us. Then, but then she called us rat. We didn't call her a rat. No, but she killed our rat. Ah. Uh. And it might have been with rat poison. So we're giving her what but she did She said, like, rat. a lot of pain. So I'm guessing she tortured the rat. Yeah, I'll just put a question mark All right. just next to it. Um, candlestick? No, I don't think the candlestick would be no, very was... clean either. Rope? Question mark? Question mark the rope, because they could be a suicide. Billiards? Nah. Okay. That's um, too violent. Broom? It seems like the sister was on good terms with the maid, so I don't think like something. I don't think the maid would go for something violent like the broom. Yeah. Mirror? That the mirror is a question mark. Yeah. Now, how are we gonna kill me? So poems, that's to frame the maid. Oh, if you do poems and rope, it might be... Ah, but the poems could prob possibly be about herself. The uh, poems were about, like, were loved ones to a maid, right? I don't know, just to a female figure. Hmm. So it could be rope and poems for suicide. I don't know what this diary is that I don't think the, the diary might be useful. A knife, I don't think so either. Leather Taus. I don't think there's enough that we can frame the father. No. And, and he doesn't hate her. Yeah. Panties. We can't really put up a scandal with the sister of the panties, can we? No. Mm, yeah. Because that would be used if you had the maid. Mm -hmm. And we found out a lot about her, so... Okay, we'll defini we're definitely going to have the poems. Yeah. And then so we will either use the mirror, the rope... Or the the rat poison. I don't think something like the rope would be would be good because it's too too big. We need something that's more delicate for like the sister and the maid. A mirror because it's her. But the problem is she wouldn't like her mirror to be smashed up. Yeah. It wouldn't be like her. Yeah. I guess the most beautiful quote quote way for her to go would be the rat poison. But it's a bit. Hmm. But it's definitely not the rope. I definitely don't think it should be the rope. Okay. It's either the mirror or the poison. But yeah, because rope, you, I think you do it during dinner time. Yeah. Anyway, wait, where was the mirror again? Uh, in Sophia's room. The maid. Okay, where was that? Um, here. Uh, yes, you have to go downstairs. In here. In there. And to the left. Oh, that was the mirrors. The mirror, mirror shard. Oh no, but where was the the poems? Oh, poems were in the piano. Oh shit! Whoops. Where was the piano again? Piano is in the room with the um, heirlooms. Ah, here, right. So you have to go out and back. Sorry. Oh, mechanics. Click and point is really useful though. Mhm. Mm Manage to force open the locked drawer inside so poem tree. Yeah, they seem to be love letters from an identified female from the description you guesses they you made. Interesting. Take! I'm sure! Intimate and love lore and poem you can find a hide in your prison. Plants in the right locations could raise interesting questions about the maid's relationship with your sister. Yes. Okay, we're gonna frame the maid then? Yes. Okay. So either the mirror or the rat poison. Ooh. Hmm. Well, the rat poison is more accessible to the maid, and the mirror. The mirror is a bit harder to get to. Yeah. The rat poison is closer to the maid, so if we want to frame the maid, I think we should go for the rat. Poison. Rat poison's in the pantry, which is up there. Swell. You're going down, Missy. Find nothing interesting at all. Blue box. Take rat poison. I'm sure. Dinner's about ready now. Ah, huh. they wait for you to finish everything. Nice. Yay, thank you. Dinner is served. Ooh, we have to do dinner talk now. Sophia, could you come here at a moment? Oh. Oh, God. Yes, ma'am. Pour me some more wine. Yes, ma'am. But, madam. Oh, what is it, George? 
I must protest. It has always been my duty to pour the wine at dinner. Oh, well, I don't want to cause any trouble. Nonsense, why? What does it matter, George? Stop being overly pedantic. But I... I... <laughs> All of these! All of these are terrifying! Uh... We can't... If we take George's side... I think the first one's really funny. Do you think you've had enough, mother? Yeah. Um... Oh, God. Definitely not the last one. And we can't take mother's side or um. Do you want to either like let George pour the wine, or you've had enough, mother? Well, if we say let George pour the wine, then if George pours the wine, we can't frame the um maid. Okay. Careful, mother. You drink too, drink much more, you might end up embarrassing yourself. Aaron! Wow. What a rude little rat you are. That's enough out of you. How dare you insult your mother? It was a joke. <laughs> and it's a few. There we go. Rat. She's pouring the wine. Yes, he is. Why can't you ever keep your mouth shut, boy? Perhaps I did speak out to him. I apologize. Yeah, yeah. Uh, too much wine myself. Better not have it, let it happen again. Sophia, could you come here, please? Yes, Miss Jennifer. I just wanted to say that was a lovely. Oh. Ah! Yes! Yeah, you made a good choice. I don't know how you do it, you cunning pixie. You're too kind, Miss. Of course, I will have tea and cakes for you in the drawing room as usual after dinner. Oh, you're so good to me, you sweet thing. So very, very good to oh, me. Oh, wait, though. Hmm. Um. That was a really bad um, replay of the music. <laughs> yeah, okay, so I think we have to make a point of those two having a thing. Would you do that? So Sophia isn't interested in your advances? Why not? Well, <gasps> if we say that, then we can make it seem like um, the sister committed suicide because the maid wasn't interested in her. But we said rat poison. Hmm. So we're trying to frame the maid. Uh, I feel like we need to make a point of those two some of being together though. So either one of the two bottom ones. Sure, make a pick. Uh, eeny, meeny, meeny. Yes, eeny meeny miny moe will solve it. Uh, okay, okay. Since since Ethan's behind us, which one do you think? Hello. Um. Okay, since you're trying to frame the maid, mm -hmm. not the last one. I think the. This one makes more of a point that there's a thing like the the would you two stop flirting with each other yeah. makes more of a point of it rather than Okay, so you know, it's more directly s saying that this. they have a thing rather than the second one. Okay. Right. And anyways, you can't do the suicide. Really, you two. You don't need to broadcast your affections so obviously in public. Ooh. Oh, I'm sorry, Master. I I never Shush, rat! Go crawling into a hole somewhere! That's qu quite enough of your silly jokes, Adam. Anyway, let's not forget why we are here today. To celebrate your father's birthday. Such a very important occasion for us, after all. You are so dear to us, Malcolm. Happy birthday, Daddy! Indeed, happy birthday, Father. Let's hope, let's hope, hope we'll be one day one want day to remember. remember. Woo! Doing, Doing the, the deed. deed. Oh. Quickly plant any of us uh, and essentially and um, um, uh, simply enter the desired room and select the item in your inventory. Okay, so where are we going to put the rat poison? Are we going to put it in the maid's room? Uh, or are we going to put it in. Who are we framing? The sister or the maid? Well, I guess it's kind of go hand in hand. Um, we can either see it as. make it look like. The sister did committed suicide because the maid didn't like her enough, or we can make it seem like the maid killed the sister because she wasn't interested and she was getting on her nerves. But then the maid seems to be really nice to the sister, so people wouldn't in, expect in public. It. Yeah, so people really wouldn't expect it from her. Yeah, we've dug ourselves a hole with this shit. 
we did a bad. Mm. Should we try and just say the sister committed suicide? Okay. But where can we put the rat poison then? Um, in the sister's room? The poems will have to go into the sister's room. And the rat poison... You'd basically have to put both in the sister's room because it doesn't make sense to put the poems in the maid's room or the rat poison in the maid's All room. All right. Enter or the well, Okay, maybe the rat poison in the maid's room, but the poem most likely... Oh, no, we have ah, evidence room. in the other Right, okay. So, poem in the sister's room. Sister's room. All right. Where are we right now? Okay, go upstairs. Go upstairs. Go upstairs. Will she be inside? No, the music. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. Oh, nice, nice. Okay. How do we do? Oh, yeah, inventory you... is the um, put uh, it on the desk. Escape was it? Escape? No, escape is. Egg, is what was it again? No, I, I, I think it was escape. Isn't it E or something? E. That's normally the inventory key. E. Nope. I. No, um, it was a weird one. Items. Oh, no, oh there we go. All right. Poem. We have to put it on the desk. All right. All right. Oh, wait, I think you... Find yourself in, your, in this room. Yes. yes. Board oh, oh, well. Shit, should have put it on the desk. Can you take it out? No, it, it automatically chooses it for you. Ah. Uh, uh, rather than, you know... Okay, then. Let's see how this plans out. So, where's the drawing room? Oh, there? With the mother? What was it? Is it in there with the mother? Or in the heirloom room? Oh no, we have to poison the sister who's in the drawing room, which is the one with the heirlooms in. Right, right, right. That's is the, that drawing the room. sister or the maid? That's the sister. Oh. Enter the drawing room. No turning back. Okay. Yes. Oh, shit. Let's go. Are we just shoving rat poison down her throat? <laughs> yeah, possibly. You may need it. Okay, you have to go to her. Click her. <laughs> Choose a murder weapon. Rat poison. Huh. Turns into the flame, devours two of them. Poison works surprisingly quick. Oh! Oh! Falls to the ground in front of you. Examine her body, make sure she isn't breathing before placing the Hold container of poison on the desk. I thought rat poison looks like blue rice. Well, it's Hong Kong. The deed is done. It's time to leave the room before someone discovers it. Quickly, quickly. Get out! Get out! Whoa. Just get out the door. Get out! Where do okay, we go? Wait, um, go upstairs to your old room? Yeah. Oh my god, there's actually a timer. Jeez. Oh my god, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Eight. Seven. We're bed. Sleeping. Bed. Oh. Just say you're in your own room. Sit, 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 sit. No! Okay. Okay. <sighs> <sighs> What's happened? What's the alibi? We were in the room. Oh, we could have said we were with mother. Shit. Shit. Good evening, everyone. I'm Chief Inspector Winston Lewis. Understand this difficult time for your family? No, it isn't. Not for us. Oh, there's lots of blood. She. Oh, I guess she threw up blood. Damn right it is. I know you're doing wasted time here, Mom. My daughter's killer is still out there. Well, Mr. Bruce, we have found no evidence of fourth century. Nobody was seen entering or leaving the house. It seemed entirely possible, then, that the killer's in the room. What? No! <laughs> that seems highly unlikely, Inspector. Perhaps it is. However, in order to follow protocol, I would still have to interview each of you in turn. Mrs. Bruce, would you like to meet me in the library first? Oh, oh no. Interview. Uh-oh. We should have been with the mother. Formalities out of the way. This isn't really necessary, I'm afraid, so turn around, please. Hmm. That's out of the way. Let's move on to the interview. In the present of the house, the time of your sister's death. We have now completed our initial search of the house. We'll get to that later. Let's start from the beginning, shall we? We run through all your activities since your arrival. Says you and the butler or blah 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 greet at the door. AT you wanted to speak and made again, which is curious. To see when dinner would be ready, because that's what we asked her. Yeah. Hungry, I want to know. It makes sense. Later on, you had a conversation with Mother Gloria in the parlor. She says you spoke briefly about your sister. You seem concerned about her. Uh, I 
We're trying to do that, aren't we? Yes, we were, we were worried. Yeah, because she talked about the mirror, the, the razor in her wrist. Yes. So we were worried my sister might attempt suicide. She had had, she had to take a note of that. You went to see your father in the library, I understand your conversation became quite heated. I thought my father, my father has always had the temper. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Father has short fuse. Many of our conversations go that way. Would you see as a violent temper? Absolutely. I see. That's good to know. You discussed the prospect of your moving back to Dunshiel. You said you would only move back if your sister was like psychiatric. For her own well-being, of course. Yes. She belonged in care. You might be right, Master Bruce. Oh, you seem the only one who felt that way. Shit. Let's discuss your conversation with the butler. I just spoke about the new maid, Sophia. The butler seems concerned about her. Um... He was just afraid of his impending retirement, was it? Oh wait, no, we said- That sounds vaguely ominous. Oh, we said he was told me that the maid was a new bully. Yeah, he told me that the new maid. Cold and heartless were the words he used. Yeah. I see, interesting. Did you speak to your sister before dinner? Yes, I yes, did. Yes, I did. So you went to see her. Yeah. Discuss of her. Uh. Uh. Well, we shouldn't Her illness, we discussed her illness and her obsessions. Oh yeah, because you we talked did. about the mirrors. Yes. Yeah. Her condition. I was aware she was going through a particularly difficult time. She seemed distressed to you. Yes, you could say that. She was not in a good place mentally speaking. I see. So we went to events that took place during dinner. Apparently you made comment about your mother's drinking habit. Uh, For her own good? We're not trying to frame the mother, so yeah, for her, I yeah. suppose so. Okay. So she's drinking far too much. Yeah, anything? To... Uh, almost certainly oh, interesting. Oh, whoops. <laughs> At one point, you made the accusation that I made assistance on appropriate age. I'm almost certain they were, because that's what we're trying to do. Yes. <laughs> well, we sort of either sister or the maid. Yeah. We believe your sister is a lesbian relationship with the maid. Almost certainly. Interesting. Now I need a certain equation at the time of your sister's death. Where were you when you heard upstairs? upstairs? Your, your old bedroom. bedroom. I see. Thank you. Complete our initial search of property. We found a poem written by your sister for... Romantic feelings towards the maid. However, from where we found the poem, there are no reasons to believe. Oh. Uh oh. Feelings unrequited love contra. Yes! Yes! <laughs> curious about the murder weapon. Poison had apparently sprinkled on uh, which the maid had prepared. We also passed through the pantry in order to speak to the maid in the kitchen. Of course, your sister may have done this itself. It was a suicide. It's all very interesting. I will be completely honest with you now, Mr. Bruce. Also, your behavior is peculiar. I find no. Yes! <laughs> We've done a murder. While there is some suspicion regarding your father, I don't currently regard him as a serious suspect. Also, think the evidence surrounding the maid might be. Okay, good. Oh, yeah. yes! Despite any question marks about your mother, I don't think in a moment she did this. Uh, the hello evidence will point towards suicide. As for what happens next, you can go for now, but I appreciate if you did not leave town. Shit! I may have more questions for you later. I think another interview with the maid will be required. Any inquest will probably consider suicide as a very real possibility. Okay. So not what we were going for, but... We did it! We killed her! We I, we said either the maid or suicide. Yeah. Although the inspector harbored his own suspicions about you, the evidence of suicide had, you had planned it was... Yes! <laughs> inquest result, clear verdict! No other heirs remaining, your father reversed his plan to cut you out as well. When your parents died, you inherited everything. Dunshiel House is yours, along with the fortune that came. However, George and Sophia found themselves unable to continue serving the place after what had happened. Woo! Woo! You spent after many long sleep and I wandered through the rooms I had. You found its emptiness reflected within yourself. Oh, oh inside. no. Uh oh. Nightmares of his sister. We feel bad. Do we? Do we? <laughs> Woo! Well, we managed to do the deed and we got cleared, so that was a good playthrough. Thank you for joining us today. We and um, this has been Jacqueline and Charlotte. So thank you and, and come me back in the again. Background. Yeah, Ethan Bye. in the background, but Bye. he's irrelevant. You know, yeah, I'm irrelevant. All right, thank you. Bye. Bye.